Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Tammy Cloutier and welcome to this presentation on the use of social media to investigate the scope of painted dog den visits by humans. Tourism has been shown to negatively impact wildlife, consequently affecting the fitness and survival of adults and young, and thus the ecosystems they inhabit. This is concerning because wildlife related tourism is a top attraction worldwide. Painted dogs are one of Africa's most endangered carnivores and also one of the most popular species on safaris. Historically found throughout Sub-Saharan Africa, they currently exist in small fragmented populations in Eastern and Southern Africa. Nomadic for most of the year, painted dogs are stationary for approximately 12 weeks during their denning season. Energetic costs are extreme during this time due to the need to quickly raise pups and become nomadic again. Tour guides and operators take advantage of this normally elusive species remaining in one area to offer clients the unique experience of observing both adults and pups. However, painted dogs were heavily persecuted and extirpated for much of their historical range and typically avoid areas of human activity, so human presence at den sites may have detrimental consequences such as interfering with foraging and social behaviors and creating additional stress by initiating extra den moves. Because the scope of painted dog den visits by humans is unknown, we used social media and image sharing platforms to determine where den visits occurred. We searched Facebook, Flickr, Instagram, and Twitter using specific criteria for images and captions. Images had to contain at least one painted dog pup of den age, which is approximately four to 12 weeks old, as well as a caption that specifically referenced that the image was obtained at a den site, such as the example you can see here on the slide. Data were then used to map the distribution of den visits, highlighting general areas within a country where people recorded their visit to a painted dog den. Out of the over 700 images we collected, 220 met our criteria. Based on this data, den visits occurred between 2008 and 2018 in seven out of the 14 African countries where painted dogs are known to persist. The majority of images collected were taken in South Africa, followed by Botswana, Zimbabwe, Kenya, Tanzania, Zambia, Namibia, and unknown locations. General locations were provided so as not to disclose specific den sites. In addition, of the 42 locations that were specifically identified, six were national parks, 31 were private game reserves. Our results demonstrate the widespread occurrence of human visits to painted dog dens, which can now be used to begin discussions, assess impacts on painted dogs and their denning success, and develop policies or regulations. While painted dogs were the focus here, this approach can be applied to other species as well. For more information, you can click on the link to our article at the bottom of the slide, or feel free to contact me with any questions. Thank you for listening.